YouTube. It is, uh, it's Wednesday. Wednesday, February 16th. I almost forgot the date. Had to look on my iPhone to check that out. Uh, February 16th, 2022. Um, 4.26 p.m. SUV was making a U-turn right behind me. That was a little unnerving. Uh, anyway, um, so I, uh, I didn't sleep very well last night. Um, don't even really want to talk about that. Uh, let's just say it kind of revolves around a, uh, certain, certain woman who rarely has anything to say to me, uh, regarding physical intimacy other than don't touch me. So, yeah. Um. Uh, yeah, I'm a grown, grown ass man with grown ass needs, and sometimes when they're not met, I just don't sleep well. Um, and I, I suppose I should uh, I should get better at coping with that. And God knows there's uh, if, if the internet is to be believed, there's plenty of uh, other men in the world who uh, are are married and not uh, not getting any. So it uh, it happens. Uh, so, I'm on my way to Amazon. It's, uh, it's uh, what a lot of people who are on my uh, my shift schedule refer to as their Friday. Um, I I get the analogy, but it's always kind of been a weird one for me because, uh, yeah, Friday is uh, Friday is Friday, and this isn't this isn't my Friday. It's just my last work day of the work week at Amazon. Uh, Thursday, I go on to have uh, have my work day at at um, Bullocks, and uh, got a lot on on a lot coming up on Bullocks, uh, sort of. Um, so I, I did get a call from Raina the other day when I was doing laundry, and I think I did mention this on an earlier vlog that the guys working on the new TV setup above the stage are finally done with it. Now, I'm, I'm really disappointed that those people never called me. Because uh, when I had initially talked to Raina about this whole thing, uh, I was I was very... You know, I gave her my ideas, and she loved my ideas, and I think that's where most stuff went from, other than I wanted to keep the old tube TVs and do some kind of a promotional slideshow on some custom hardware that would output to them. I, I thought that would look kind of neat, seeing two super old-school CRTs that have been in that location for... <laughs> probably over 20 years, maybe 25 years, um, actually having an image on them of current information. I thought that would be kind of a fun, fun retro throwback. That bar is kind of a fun retro throwback kind of place. But um, I, I guess the uh, Jim, who's, I hate to say main owner, you know, to, 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 to say Jim is the main owner and you know, Raina's just his wife, I think, kind of minimizes her contributions to the bar. But uh, Jim Jim is the one who uh, tends to uh, take the proverbial bull by the horn when it comes to things at that bar. So uh, I, I guess once once he saw stuff was being done there and is like decided now is the time to, to upgrade those TVs, which is fine. Um, I'm super curious to see what was put in. I had, I had specifically asked Raina to have the guys doing the work contact me so that I could work with them. I was honestly hoping I'd get a little bit more, little, little additional work and pay out of it. Um, and and it just so happened that I ended up starting like the the following week. I ended up starting at Amazon and really had no time for it. And. And they didn't even get started until, like, after I had started on Amazon. So I, I still would have liked to have had some some actual contact. Because, I, you know, I made sure that Raina had my number to pass on to them. And I was hoping I could at least have some, you know, communication with them as far as letting them know what my needs are and what my, you know, wishes are. And, and, and maybe, you know, kind of... I was hoping it would be, like, one of those sort of things where... Where there, those guys were doing the, the physical, you know, physical installation of, you know, cutting and nailing wood and putting in brackets and, 
and that sort of stuff, and that I could do all the uh, all the electronics and configuration of you know whatever whatever's getting thrown at it. Um, and of course, my intentions were. I, I don't even know if they've added any additional uh, satellite tuners to it. My intentions were definitely not to do that. Um, I figure we got more than enough uh, tuners that can be uh, piggybacked on. Um, I have no idea. I have no idea what, what has been done. Uh, again, Raina told me about it, said everything was done. As far as she knew, knows everything is done. And she said, well, everything's all hooked up. But, you know, to say everything's all hooked up, they don't know what my needs are for, to accommodate me to have it hooked up. I mean, they, they, never, they never called me. So I'm willing to bet money that it's not all hooked up to suit my needs. Um, and and the, the bummer thing about it is that I'm, you know, with my Amazon schedule, I'm absolutely not going to have time to go there until at best... Uh, Thursday afternoon and there's a you know that that's gonna give me time to look things over probably not hook things up because I mean I'm, I'm gonna need to you know when I look look things over I'm gonna have to basically figure out what all I need and then obtain it and then get it there and then put it in and when you put my you know lack of add, add on to that my lack of time lack of available time and particularly lack of transportation, you know, at least lack of money is not a big deal. If I do need to buy any cables or whatever, like I, I can, it's not a problem. Although I always prefer to use already existing cables, but, hmm, fire truck. um, yeah, I always prefer to use already, you know, things I already have. Um, and I always like it when I can actually you know, have some kind of a billable sale as far as, you know, for, for cabling and installation and whatnot. So I kind of feel like I got sidestepped out of the little, that a little bit. And, and maybe, you know, I guess that's what I get for just talking to Raina about it and not taking the time to actually also talk to, uh, talk to Jim and kind of sell myself on that. Cause I, I don't think Jim understands like my capabilities as a audio video, uh, installer. And, and how good I am at you know, system configuration. I mean, I would think he would kind of know just based on what I have done to accommodate my show and the TVs that I've, I've got in there. And then, you know, what little bit I did to, to bring sound uh, to their old karaoke sound system from, uh, from the satellite receiver that runs up to their projector uh, for, for sound on games, which I initially did, you know, back back last year when the Suns were in the playoffs and we were getting great turnout for Suns games. Anyway, um, yeah, I don't know what's awaiting me when I get there Thursday, but kind of, kind of, kind of eager and kind of excited. And then on the same, same token, I'm kind of a little frustrated that everything's kind of gone down the way it has with it because I, I know the odds of me being able to utilize any of it on my show on Thursday are pretty slim pretty slim and, and that kind of makes me wish I still had because I'm sure they accommodated the I, I'm, I'm willing to bet they accommodated the house karaoke system which is really archaic and feeds video via composite and, and looks terrible um, and, and part of me is thinking you know maybe I should be trying to sell Jim on having me upgrade that and do work on that but given the choice uh, and, and, and now with the situation with Amazon, of course, that throws a, throws a whole curveball. But prior to the job at Amazon, uh, given the choice between setting that up and improving that system and just ignoring it and, and leaving it to, you know, decay and become uh, more and more obsolete by the week uh, so that at some point he would decide that it's better to just have me do karaoke all week. Uh, you know, that was kind of where I was leaning is, is the better option. And, and as I've said before, I have no intentions of trying to push Gary out. Love Gary to death. Always have a great time with Gary Oki. But I, uh, I, I do wonder when and if he's ever going to retire. Uh, I, 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 
I feel at this point, it's with other stuff I get going on in my life, it's highly likely, and as frustrated as I've been with my shows there lately, which is not so much my shows there, but just there are times the, the crowd just really upsets me. Um, just people not respecting my personal space, people just being excessively rude, and the, the fact that just most people absolutely don't tip. They're incredibly demanding, but yet they don't tip. There's a racial stereotype in there. I'm just going to leave that alone. Um, yeah, I, uh, somewhat burned out on, on that whole, on, on the whole thing because of that. Uh, so it's, it's debatable as to whether I'm, uh, you know, I mean, I'm not, don't get me wrong. I'm not looking to leave anytime soon. I'm really not. Of course, last Thursday I was like (laughs) ready to grab my stuff and walk the hell out an hour before the end of my show but that's you know that's a that's a separate tragedy but um yeah uh yeah it's uh i don't know hard to see time will tell how it will go so as you see we got two bird two bird skeeters here in case you're wondering why the hell i was walking northbound on on the green belt uh when i'm on my way to amazon there are two bird, bird scooters here. I had an absolute blast. The, now, interesting, the map only shows one here, so I'm assuming one's got a pretty low battery. But anyway, um, and there's the Thomas bus. Yeah, not dealing with you today, Thomas bus. Um, obviously, it's going to cost me a little bit more because this is a half mile further uh, of ride that I've added by walking up this way. But I was pleasantly surprised when I checked the, a couple hours ago, checked the... Uh, check the bird app to see that there was actually one walking distance that was clearly in a spot where it would be accessible and not potentially in somebody's apartment so um on that note i'm gonna wrap this up uh fire up my bird app and um ride myself a scooter down to 50th street station anyway thanks thanks for coming with me on the walk um actually you know what i think i'm gonna do a uh, video right after this once i unlock the scooter so be sure to check for that uh and and if you're wondering like why sometimes you the notifications that that ebay sends out are never really in the order i upload it's just the nature of the beast with ebay or i'm sorry not ebay but uh with uh with youtube but uh whenever you get to my channel the the, the, probably the best way to watch it so things chronologically make sense is, is just to hit the the channel and list the videos and everything's got a number if you watch them in numerical order do make a lot more sense so anyway whatever the hell the number of this video is there will be another one with the same number and a point one added to the end of it and that will be me uh riding on this lovely word scooter down to 50th street uh 50th street station so uh so be sure to watch that once you're done with this